I think the most valuable uh, experience for me at UPrep was when I was elected ASB president of the school because it really was a symbol from how far I've gone from just being a nervous little sixth grader to being student body president. I feel like everybody, the thing that's different at least about UPrep is that everybody like wants to be here and so all the people here are really nice and really I can get along with them really easily. Meeting my teachers on the first day was important because um, it's good to know your teachers and Mr. Mock was great. He was a great core teacher and Mrs. Bird was great too and all the teachers were great. Because on the first like day they have you do little activities to kind of get to know other people. Um, last year for my first period was PE and I made most of my friends in that class and I would always talk to them and I had most of them in my other classes so I'm still really close with those friends today. I came into this knowing only one person so I definitely had to make a lot of new friendships so like now with the friends that I have I go over to their houses like spend the night over there. So something very valuable to me at UPrep uh, probably was the athletic program more specifically um, playing volleyball and just really connecting with the team and building friendships. Um, I think being in dance one sixth grade year was really valuable because Mrs. Zittle and she was amazing she was like a best friend to me and she listened to whatever we said. One of my favorite things has been choir. He's one of my favorite teachers, Mr. Powers. He's really nice and he could be a friend with anybody. I think that being in the Chinese class was a really valuable experience and it's not as much of a reading from a book as a, like talking and interacting with different people. I've had the chance to be involved with student government for around two years now and before I had done that I didn't realize like how much you know, our school really did until I was the one planning it. And it was really kind of cool. Setting up the dances is fun and kind of realizing that those just don't happen in the middle of the night. People have to work and set them up. What really makes it worth it is seeing the new, especially the kids on their first dance, like sixth graders coming into their first dance, is their faces like light up and with a big smile and like making people like excited and happy and especially at like games, getting the crowd excited is definitely really fun. I really value how we're so closely connected as a small school and how we have that connection between the junior high and the high school. Uh, I think that we really serve as positive role models. All of the high school cheer team and then the junior high cheer team get together um, to combine one big team and we go a full out performance during homecoming halftime. Over the summer uh, we have junior high camps um, so volleyball the varsity team we go and help um, run the junior high camp which is fun because we get to you know be their mentor and they really look up to us so it's good to kind of build relationships there because like um, during a football game, one of the little girls, like just a girl came up to me and she's like, oh, I remember you from the camp. I'm like, oh, cool. And so she told me about like her volleyball experience over her season. So it was really cool to kind of like reconnect with them. I love the coach, Mr. Nichols. He likes to help a lot. Like if you're having trouble with something, he'll help you individually, make sure that you've got it before you move on to something else. I have like lots of teachers that I am really close to. Um, one is Mrs. Bird. She's one of my favorite. Um, and Mrs. Adams. She like always tells you like you can do it and she always believes in you and she's really nice and awesome. I wasn't really good at strings because everyone else had experience except me and Miss Johnson always took the time to help me and then I was first chair for the concert and Miss Johnson always helped me. Like she would always give me individual help even after class. I think that I made a lot more of a uh, relationship with my teachers because I've had to go and ask them for help instead of being able to know everything before because it was really easier, a lot easier. But then I had to go talk to them and ask them questions and then I uh, got to know them a little bit better. Both like peers and uh, teachers, staff members, they're always very encouraging and willing to hear what you have to say. That's made the relationships that I've formed here so much more like natural, like I feel like I can be myself here around other students. Throughout the entire time I've been here, it's just always been like I've had friends close and it's like I don't 
I don't, there's not a day that goes by that I don't know someone. Everyone gets to know each other, so it's really not like you're ever alone. 